Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Hope you're all doing great and welcome to this new video uh, on, um, on Bonk, obviously. Or at least, uh, obviously, I, I wanted to cover some meme coins this morning after this uh, this morning. But, but yesterday, like over the course of yesterday, it was very bearish already as well. We saw a bit of a bloodbath. Right, if you if you look at this morning and, and you look at the relative strength, um, you can see that even very recently, like almost two hours ago or so, no, one hour ago, we had some massive sell-offs, and with which cryptos were hit the hardest, it's meme coins. Like meme coins, especially earlier in the morning, around six a.m. in my time zone, uh, meme coins started to to really underperform the market. Uh, you can see that Bitcoin started to fall down, uh, and at the same point of time, the Bitcoin dominance went up. Um, you saw the altcoin market fall down a lot, which meme coins right now are, are a significant part of the altcoin market. So that does matter a lot. Uh, and that brings us to the current situation where a coin like Bonk, on the short term, but I would say on the long term, um, like, like on the short term, it's very bearish, of course. All right. Even on the four hour time frame, um, we've already hit, uh, we've already had two massive bearish breakouts. First of all, by breaking down below 4,000 right here. Um, right here and then also breaking down below 3600 right here and um, so that's technically that's bearish on the one hour time frame we've had even more bearish confirmations but even if you if you really zoom out like a chart like this is hard to call bearish all right a chart like this is is, is in my opinion still bullish uh, but even if you look at it like that like right now we found support at the 100 ema with the zero point um with the 0 0.618 fib here um, we need a lot of bullish momentum from here to really turn bullish on the short term again. And I'm not sure if we can. Like at this moment, I, I, I need to see a very strong Bitcoin. And at this moment, I don't see that. I just see a, a relatively strong Bitcoin because Bitcoin is actually still uh, holding on relatively fine. Um, but then you see Bonk right here. And Bonk has lost a ton of momentum. Bonk has seen a ton of bearish confirmations here. So... If you like Bonk, this is a pretty negative video, so I'm, I'm sorry, but that is the situation here, All right? I, I do think that the current support we found, so around 3200, I think that holds, All right? So I think Bonk from here can actually gain some momentum back up to 3500, potentially back up to 3700, but I don't see any reason yet why we would break out. I think it's most, most likely that we'll consolidate here. And uh, then we will just break out to the sides where Bitcoin goes. All right. So today, what's also still possible, especially since the, the dumping we saw this morning um, was pretty violent. All right. That could continue today and we could drop down lower than 3200. But the main thing we need to see is, is some sort of some sort of resolution from Bitcoin. So either a, a rally back up to 69,500. Uh, then Bonk can back, get, get back up to 3700 and we can start talking about potentially breaking above that, even though I don't expect that. But if Bitcoin falls down lower today uh, towards 65,500, for example, there is also a chance that Bonk drops down to the next support level uh, right here between 3000 and 2900, which is even stronger than 3200, the current support level. Uh, but it's it's obviously lower in price. So you have some some good sides to it and some and, and some bad sides um but I, I think this is most likely i think we'll be able to hold the support level and consolidate on top of it for for a little bit at least for like 24 hours or so and then after that we need to wait for confirmation and we need to wait for direction from the markets but those are my thoughts that's what i think you need to know for now if you do have any questions let me know down in the comments but for now thank you for watching take care and bye